right now. Cadwell Park is turning off its engines and putting its skates on as the annual Gravity Racing Festival arrives this weekend. The event on Sunday features skateboarders, soapbox racers and BMX cyclists. Philip Norton has been along for a preview. It's the sort of safety gear you'd normally associate with superbikes at Cadwell Park but this is far from high octane. It's gravity racing, and there's not the slightest whiff of petrol in the air. So what will you see in gravity racing? Well, as the name suggests, there's no engines, but you will see these. This is a soapbox racer. It costs around 500 pounds. It's been built from scratch and can reach up to 50 miles an hour. The same for this. This is a gravity bike. As you can see, it's a, a modified BMX, but the pedals have been taken off and there's no chain there. And this is a skateboard. These are used as well, but the main thing here is the protection. Special gloves to stop your hands being shredded on the tarmac. The thrill of coming down the hill, it's just such a buzz. The steering is very light. It's uh, almost like driving a Formula 1 car at times, in that the slightest turn it can have such a large movement on the car. When you've got levers on like they save you a bit. When you haven't got levers, you lose a bit of skin. You're always coming off, but grows back so it's quite a lot of technology involved in the sport which people don't appreciate they think it's falls going down a hill the event has twice as many entrants as last year such as the growing popularity of the sport and there's an educational side too a school in Immingham is using the event as part of coursework we're going to be looking at product design and you look at all the graphic works that needed doing on it let alone the engineering side so it's going to cut across all subject areas but it's not all smooth running. Thankfully, all the safety equipment meant nobody was injured. Philip Norton, BBC Look North, Cadwell Park in Lincolnshire. And if you're going to the uh, gravity racing on uh, Sunday, then enjoy whatever you've got planned uh, this weekend. And I hope it goes uh, very well indeed. Thank you for watching. Uh, now, just finally, let's have a recap on tonight's main national and regional headlines. Uh, the weather.